Well, it's a decades-long tradition that a St. Michael mom says is outdated. And now she's trying to get the fight song at her kid's school changed, claiming the lyrics are sexist. Fox 9's Courtney Godfrey has more. on the gym walls at St. Michael Albertville High School are the lyrics to the school's official song. One line in particular drawing some recent attention. It's infuriating to me to listen to a song only sung for half the school. It's that reference to sons that has Mother Kara Lewis fighting for change. When your school isn't showing that they want to include you in something as, as big and broad as the school song, yeah, that's hurtful. She says her two daughters, who are going into ninth and 10th grade, would like to feel represented in the school fight song, proposing that the line, loyal sons, be changed to loyal knights in reference to the school's mascot. But she says despite her relentless efforts, the district and the school board haven't shown any interest in changing it. When I talk to other parents or coaches, they don't understand why it hasn't happened yet. And um, I guess that's confusing to me too. In a statement, the superintendent says the district continues to examine this public issue and has provided a forum and opportunity for the concerned individual to express her viewpoints on this issue. The University of Notre Dame, where the song originated, changed the lyrics this year to be more inclusive, replacing sons with sons and daughters. And Lewis says with this week marking the 50th anniversary of Title IX, there's no better time for St. Michael Albertville to jump on board. I support boys, but imagine saying uh, a girl's song to the boys football team. I think it might get a different uh, response.